And if you're like me, after the holidays, you never want to see another cookie again. Or at least you say that until about January 15th. And maybe this is the year that you want to achieve those health goals. Today, we talked to one of my favorite dietitians and moms, Kristen Kirkpatrick with the Cleveland Clinic. And she shares the exact same advice that she gives to her patients who want to start out on a new track. So really focusing on, okay, what is uh, my age? What is my activity level? What am I able to do? Maybe my ability is to lose a half a pound a week, or maybe it's one pound. I also have really been talking a lot more with my patients to encourage them to make our goals more oriented to our metabolic profile. Mm. So it's very natural to, I, I always joke that every woman, at least everyone I know, and I'm guilty of this as well, has a pair of jeans stuck in the back of the closet that don't fit, but you're always like, one day I'm gonna get into those jeans, right? Um, and even though we laugh about that, those genes are actually a much better assessment of what your metabolic goals are versus the scale, because it, it's going to look at your belly fat. So really kind of changing the semantics and saying, okay, my goal is not to lose 15 pounds, but my goal is to get my LDL and my cholesterol to come down. And what does it take to make that happen? Kristen also dropped this bomb. Your metabolism doesn't change in your 30s and 40s. New studies show it is actually more like your 60s. So your healthy habits can give you great overall wellness. To see the entire conversation, all you have to do is go to our WKYC Plus channel, which you can find on Roku and Fire TV. You can also see the episode on your WKYC YouTube channel. And I joke with Kristen that we do this like every year where I talk to her about, okay, what, if, what do people wanna do? But this time she really sat down and talked about she talked as if, you know, you were sitting in her office, you're a new patient, and you're just saying, I have this goal or I have that goal, and what she has her patients do. And she didn't focus on, you need to eat broccoli and not sugar, you know, yeah. but it was more about like, how to track your wellness and how to approach things in a healthy Practical way. Things. And she does give us her favorite fad diet. You know how there's always these fad yeah. diets or way, ways to eat? She does talk about her favorite way of eating okay. too. So, yeah. Sometimes